God started revealing this revelation, I had to upgrade your type. It's gonna be trading faith. It's gonna take you trading where you can your faith. And what we have to do, which is a very serious thing for people, is trade it for the presence of what God. Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Izzelim Dalani. For those of you who do not know, welcome, darling. Hello, king. Hello, queen. If it is your first time here, ta -da! welcome. To me, lang, 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 to me, lang. Guys are probably wondering uh, why I am not at work. If you all wait, today is a Tuesday. Guys, I didn't even lay my wig, so please do not judge me if you happen to notice as well. If you didn't now you know i just got back from johannesburg it was such an amazing time it was such an amazing time i had such a good time you guys i miss a lot of people i just had to go in there to just like get some fresh air but anyway it is hot you guys i think that's another reason why i also just don't want to lay my way because anyway it's gonna lift we headed out to get manje i just got back in i just arrived please excuse the quality of this part of the vlog but yeah we just got in and i'm wearing this dress that i got from mr price very very simple dress um very it's like a shirt dress i'll try and show you guys properly when i step out but i'm headed out right now to meet my friend Opilila. she just called me through for lunch so we headed there guys i don't know why i lie i have not been okay i'll tell you guys what happened i went out right i mean as i was i was as i was flying back from from Joburg, guys i had a situation where i literally ran out of breath i ran out of breath at the airport not even at the airport inside the plane i was grasping grasping for air i was grasping for air it wasn't even funny okay it wasn't even funny it was the worst thing that i could ever imagine because what what do you do what do you do you you are so high up and i don't know maybe it's because i haven't really been drinking much water because this has really been keeping me balanced it's really been keeping me you know it's really been keeping me balanced a lot <laughs> So I don't know if it was maybe just a shortage of water. I'm still feeling a bit lightheaded, but I literally just couldn't breathe. I had to grasp for air. 
if it wasn't for the ladies that were sitting next to me child i don't know really don't know what i was gonna do because they say i was literally saying my prayers I was like god if this is how i'm gonna die <sighs> i'm speaking calmly because i'm out of energy but buffet buffet guys life is a precious gift and it can end just like that just like that but anyway i don't want to depress you guys let's go this looks like i'm wearing uh, that with my new loafers i got these from legit are they loafers i think they're called loafers but anyway that is the fit izaza mtaneni we're here how is it? Oh my god, and it's literally like the same kind. <laughs> exactly, oh, exactly. At Willie's now. My friend's hair, guys. My hair. Alright, <laughs> okay, guys. So I came through to Willie's to get a gift for Lindy's birthday. It was actually yesterday. Uh, guys, my sinuses are so, so bad. Like from the time I was in Johannesburg until now, it's like so, so, so bad. Listen, you plan. But anyway, heading home now. We've got no shedding right now from six to 10. I don't know what we're gonna do to kill time but the heat guys no man i don't know what you guys have done to upset jesus oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm watching the, uh, the Real Housewives of Durban. Guys, when I say the drama, guys, bear with me. I didn't realize that in this part of the clip, my camera was not showing my full face. Just give me about 20 seconds. This is what I have to say. I promise you, it's going to change. Thanks. Obviously, this is like still the first episode. But I just came here to say it's been barely, what, I'm, I'm how many minutes in? I just got back from work. Um, I'm only 19 minutes in on a 50, 47 minutes episode one. Do you understand? And already there's people calling each other names. Guys, if you recently watched my sit down video where I talked about letting go, this is exactly why you need to let go. I feel like it's so tricky with female friendships it's so tricky with female friendships sometimes and so unnecessary because why do we have to start having names for each other like unnecessarily so i don't know how this uh season is gonna go but i really really like eat desperate how eat desperate housewives i really really love eat eat real housewives of durban um, there's this new girl who's just come in what's her name Amanda, I think it's Amanda. I just love the authenticity. Like, you know, the fact that it's you gonna get see. Alright. Girls with taxi families, staff business. Yeah. I don't wanna say it's a word. But I know that's right. 
oh okay she just rolled up in a g-wagon <laughs> it's a wednesday and i'm kind of recovering from something that i think is a flu i'm not sure what's happening but as you can hear i'm very nasally my sinuses have just been acting up since yesterday today was a nightmare waking up it was a nightmare you guys so enjoying i really really do hope that i'm audible enough and that you guys can see me properly and whatnot but i'm cooking i'm gonna have supper and um i haven't really been committed to this vlog shame i don't want to lie to you guys and i'm sorry for that but there's just been a lot um there's also just me learning my lyrics and just i think because from the weekend i've been around a lot of people and up until last night where i was with um umama who has invited me um to sing at this event this wedding right and we had such a lovely time guys i always say you know what it's not a mistake that we meet certain people in our lives and sometimes we meet them maybe i meet them through invites and whatnot but there are good people out there who really are just about genuine uh relationships genuine growth and that really have your best interest in heart that believe in you i'm not talking eh, about people who come with that type of front and then turn out to be obsessed and turn out to be different things hey guys yeah i wonder if i was to tell you some of the things that i've actually gone through but one day soon once everything is sorted and i keep throwing jabs at this about things that i've been going through but Cindy, i will come back and i'll let you guys in on uh, like a lot of things but Cindy, it's been it was such a nice conversation we we prayed we went through the items that i will be rendering and it was just so comforting to just have someone who believes in you and uh, believes in you from the first time they met you who sees you you know who sees your gift and your talent for what it purely and really really is and i always thank god for my invites because i've always just i've always just believed and i've always seen that they've always been god god ordained you know it may just be something that happened at that time but it always turns out to be a way that god is speaking to me or a way of god of god building relations with me and those people for a certain purpose and just growing in the lord and operating in your purpose is a beautiful thing so right now i'm just like really um <clears throat> i was supposed to have a meeting today but my flu was just not allowing me to be around anyone i just really needed to time like some time out and i think my body was also just shutting down and it's very important guys to have your zen moment to have your zen day i was also fasting today so i was very very drained as well um not too drained but you know what i mean so i just decided to just collect myself a bit and to just time out and just point to myself to the things that i love watch things that i love you know what i mean <laughs> that make me laugh but yeah i hope um by the time this vlog comes up i hope everything has been good for you guys y'all know i don't like talking too much in my vlogs but yeah good morning guys good morning yeah it's a gold and it's a gold and it's a gold i am going to work right now and yeah i think i did i'm going to work the next day let me greet y'all properly it's weird how we greet each time on a different clip of a vlog as vloggers because <laughs> i don't know if i guess we feel like each day is a new day and we, i don't know but anyway good morning it's morning on my side and i don't know which part of this vlog you're choosing to watch but anyway it's chai yay speaking of chai guys i'm just like what is going on what is go why you i don't want to go into this topic but hey it's like why why ah what a fun man ah oh what yeah, but I try one. I, 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 I. Says the Korean man, book, book, true. Says like manufacturer corner. I try tea. 
Booga. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Because what the what the hell? What the hell guys? What the hell? And you know, if you know me personally, I've always been an advocate for don't don't uh, don't approach relationships or men with this idea you're going to they owe you something. They need to provide I boy, this is another person's child who has a living who who I mean who who earns an honest living and who has bills to pay, a rent to pay for himself. Guys, relationships are not about milking each other dry. If you cannot afford to do some of the things that you want from another person, why are you de demanding it? And 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 if it's not like guys, me and guys, and guys, what's happening to most females in our society? But it's not shy. It is not shy. And as Futsi, where the chai even applies in this sense, but it's not giving. It's not giving what it's supposed to give. And I just feel like it's very, it's putting the rest of us females in such a bad light. And Batik S is Otini. It's not all of us that subscribe to that kind of, uh, uh, you know, mindset and to that kind of thinking. Um, me not shame. Me not shame. Shame, dear king. I, I I I just feel like I don't know guys I just feel like really something needs to give let's 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 all work hard and life is about getting to that point in your life where you can provide to you, for yourself that's what everybody's doing provide for yourself you understand yes I don't like the benefits are nice when the man knows what to do when he needs to do it but Nakona it's if he wants to do it don't don't come with expectations hi bar hey guys for those of you who don't know what uh, i'm referring to there's just this trending video on tiktok about a female who's talking about if a man this if a man that if a man it's shy it's shy because if you're there but that but that hey okay let me compose myself i just don't like how it's presented some of us i feel like we've just come from utando guys the bash you know a humble girl who put us out there in the us girlies who are nice <laughs> us girlies who are groomed well <sighs> guys but anyway bottom bottom line we need to stop we really need to stop i'm at work now i look actually look so puffy i look so puffy gilalele it's looking busy new housewives of devil but see it is what it is I'll see you guys later. Little bit, a little vlog, yeah. Got a bag. Yeah. 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 For working so hard during the week. So I'm gonna close off the vlog here. And if I offended anyone, I'm speaking my own opinion. I'm sorry. But I just had to, I felt like I needed to say that. So, I just wanna say. Thank you so much for watching. Like if you have not subscribed. If you have not, we're on our way to one thousand subscribers. And yeah, I'll definitely see you guys in the weekend vlog that I will put up. Bye.